Okay, it's that time of the semester in every English class. Peer review. This week, I want you to write a whole first draft of your paper and share it with your peer partner. Collaboration, in my opinion, is one of the most important parts of the writing process. Even though I'm not the biggest fan of peer review myself, I do definitely see its merits. Peer review helps you get your assignment ready before the day that it's due, helps you get your ideas for your own work, and offers comments that might enrich your own writing from a different perspective. Also, writing is a social activity, right? You know, what would be the point of writing if there was no one to share it with? Peer review helps us to practice that dimension of writing as well. Now, to complete the peer review, I just want you to follow a few steps. Draft your entire paper. Then go to the Tools tab and select Email. Once you choose Select Users, you can find your peer's name and send your paper as an email attachment. As the assignment sheet for the peer review, which you can find here, says, you should email your paper by Friday this week and return it by Monday with at least five helpful comments. Copy me on both emails so that I can give you full credit. Okay? Okay. Now, as for the draft itself, I want you to follow the IMRAD format. IMRAD, I-M-R-D, stands for Introduction Methods Results Discussion, which is a list of the main parts of the paper that I think you should include. For an eight-page paper, I would recommend that you spend about a page on intro material. That includes the attention getter, significance and exigent statements, main purpose statement, and preview of the main points. Then you should transition to the literature review and methods section. About two to five pages, maybe, where you discuss your secondary research, describe your primary research methods, and share your results. Then transition again to the final section, the discussion section where you can spend the last pages offering new insights that you have learned while researching this topic. Calls to attention that you want your reader to do now that they have learned from your paper. And concluding remarks that you wish to impart for likely a better, brighter future. I think this will be a difficult week, writing-wise. But the great news is that from the proposal, annotated bibliography, literature review, and primary research methods assignments, it's really just a matter of cutting and pasting your already existing writing, right? Now, if you do have questions, I'm happy to answer them. Please do let me know. Okay, so after you finish your IMRAD draft and the peer review process, you'll send your papers to me for more feedback, and then we'll basically be done for the class. So hang in there. We're almost through. Good luck, and take care.